Hey guys, Brady here with your daily tennis lesson, talking about the fourth pillar of successful tennis today, which is power. You know, we've been through the first pillar, which is consistency, the second, which is depth, the third, which is placement. And if all three of those ideas are clicking for you guys and you feel confident on those other building blocks, it's time to hit the ball a little bit harder. Um, you know, what I kind of tend to see a lot is that at the 3035 level, the, the number one goal for beginning players is to learn to hit the ball hard. And so they find a way to swing fast and then they're able to hit the ball hard and then they're trying to learn how to put it in the court. And there's only a couple players in history I know that have done that well. One is Andre Agassi. The other's Mark Philippoussis. Those guys from a young age were taught to just hit the ball as hard as they could and then their coaches and their dads and all that stuff kind of refined them. Most of us don't have that luxury of, of learning how to hit hard and then keeping the ball in the court. So first and foremost, you know, if you guys have watched our other videos, you recognize that consistency, depth, and placement are all very reliant on good footwork, good balance, and good technique in the stroke, and power is, is the exact same. We cannot plan on hitting the ball harder, you know, around the court, deeper in the court, off to the sides of the court. Can't plan on hitting those shots harder if we don't have a stable foundation and good footwork. So I'm gonna back up and hit a couple balls. The first couple I won't hit them very hard, but I'm gonna just remind myself that the goal here is to achieve those first three pillars before I allow myself to hit the ball hard. One more. Okay, so I got those in, I got them deep, and I moved them off the side of the court. So I feel like I've knocked those first three pillars off at that point, my confidence is high, and that's what you guys should feel, is that you're feeling good about your game, good about the control of the ball, and at that point, then we try to swing a little bit bigger, okay? And we have some videos out there on, on actually how to hit that ball harder, so go ahead and take a look at those. But, you know, my confidence was high off the first two or three swings, so then, I don't feel anything but good about attempting those shots with a little more pace. And that's, that's what I want you guys to get to is, it's very fun to hit for power, but don't make it the number one pillar for success. It comes last after we've achieved those other three, okay? So that's all I got for you guys today. Please click like below this video. And if you happen to be watching on YouTube, please subscribe to our channel. Thanks and we'll see you guys soon.